Let's look into the polarization by scattering effects. Here is the index. I am going to talk about the polarization and polarization by scattering. Polarization is a property that can oscillate with more than one orientation. Electromagnetic waves such as light exhibit polarization as with some other types of waves such as gravitational force and waves. So this is the question, what makes the sea blue? You are able to see once the sunlight is there, the sea waves are reflecting the blue light and which is shown a scattered light from the sky. These are considered as absorbed lights and the reflected is a blue light. The light from a clear blue portion of the sky shows a rise and fall of intensity when viewed through a polaroid which is rotator. This is nothing but sunlight which has changed its direction on encountering the molecules of the earth's atmosphere. Polarization of the blue scattered light from the sky, the incident sunlight is unpolarized, dots and arrows. A typical molecule is shown. It scatters light by 90 degree, polarized normal to the plane of the paper. As figure shows, the incident sunlight is unpolarized. The dot stands for Polarization perpendicular to the plane of the figure, the dots. The double arrow shows a polarization in the plane of the figure. There is no phase relationship between these two in unpolarized light. Under the influence of the electrical field of the incident wave, the electrons in the molecules acquire components of motion in both this direction. We have drawn an observer looking at 90 degree to the direction of the sun. Clearly, charges accelerating parallel to the double arrows do not radiate energy towards this observer since their acceleration has no transverse component. The radiation scattered by the molecule is therefore represented by dots. It is polarized perpendicular to the plane of the figure. This explains the polarization of scattered light from the sky.